Aloha my kako. Woo, look at this hat. My goodness. What a silly one it is. <laughs> we do what we can to protect ourselves from the UVs. But the sun, this time of day, the portal opens up. Hoakea. Surrounded with a lay of clouds at the base. And our cloud friends up at the Vawakua, up high. I am a couple of miles from my house at the tree sanctuary where I just pop out to tune in, to get away from the computer, away from the laundry, <laughs> away from the hustle and bustle. And the hustle and bustle of, of my inner world to connect with the outer world. So this tree sanctuary is indeed that. It is a tree sanctuary. It is a sanctuary for my soul, for the pohaku, the stones. There's a helicopter going over. <sighs> there is a sense of deep peace that is accessible to us in any moment. Sometimes I go outside to be reminded of it. And when I'm outside, I do the deep breath because the deep breath, then when I do it indoors, when I'm at the computer, when it's the wee hours of the night, whatever the case may be, then I'm able to access it. And it's a portal to another dimension. It just brings me right back out here, seriously. So I'm at elevation, I'm getting some, some good workout. This is helping my half marathon training. This is helping my heart, which you know, if I wanna get really clear on my messaging with you, really clear on my story, it's how to heal heart health. That's what's most important so that we can avoid the pokey, sticky, proddy, owie moments that then we spin in our minds over and over again and they land lodged in our hearts like stones of resentment. It is up to us right now to drop the stones of resentment. So whatever you're doing, I invite you to pause right now. I'm gonna pick up a pohaku, a stone. It's about the size of the heart, the fist size. I'm gonna bring it here. I'm gonna put in whatever lingering resentments, whatever owies are there. Breathe into it, feel the heat, feel the transmission, and drop the stones of resentment from the heart. Aloha, you matter, your relationships matter.